now we are going to discuss question number 5.32 and this is again a very good question and in this question it is given to you a block of mass 25 kg is raised by a 50 kilogram main in two different ways clear so concentrate let's suppose here we have a person i am taking mass of a person that is capital m so capital m is given to you 50 kg and we can see mass of a block is given to you this is 25 kg small, small m equal to 25 kg okay fine clear now in this question it is given that a person can uh, a person can raise this block by the two ways number a and number b clear what is the action on the floor by men in two different cases if the floor yields to a normal force of 700 newton it means if we are applying more than 700 newton force on this floor definitely this floor collapse clear so now we have to find which mode should the men should adopt to lift the block without floor yielding clear so it means what is ultimate objective of this question ultimate objective of this question is to calculate net force or we can say reaction force that is exerted by all the system on a floor clear so how can we calculate concentrate here let's suppose if i concentrate on a part number a listen very carefully i can say here in part number a force is acting 25 g clear everyone now let's suppose i am saying here we have tension t if we talk about from this point we have tension t in a downward direction definitely because this is a person i can say 50 g force is also acting in a downward direction and Definitely when force is acting on a floor definitely according to Newton's third law floor will also exert a force in an upward direction Yes, so I can say this is given by a normal reaction n or you can say this is Reaction force clear. So from here we can write like this Reaction this is given by tension T plus I can say this is 50 G clear Now we can see this T is equal to 25 G Yes or no? So at this time I can see 25G plus 50G. This should be equal to 75G. Clear? Now let's suppose I am taking value of G 9.8. Then I can say this is 98 divided by 10. Yes or no? We can write like this. I can say this is 2. We have this is uh, 5. This is 15. Yes or no? Yes, from here we can say this one is 49, clear? So how can we multiply 15 with 49? I can write like this, this is 15 min 50 minus 1. So this is equal to 750 minus 15. So from here we can see norm, uh, reaction force that I am getting 735 Newton, clear everyone? So reaction force I am getting 735 Newton, clear? So now in this question it is given to you the floor yields to a normal force of 700 newton and actually this floor is exerting a reaction force this is equal to 735 newton it means we are also exerting same force on this floor and definitely if we consider this force definitely i can say this floor will collapse clear everyone it means i will not adopt uh, process number or we can say i will not adopt this uh, process number a clear everyone now let us try to understand that if I accept mod number B that what will happen clear so now concentrate we can see from here you can see our objective in this question is to calculate reaction force exerted by a floor on this uh, floor on this person clear so first let us try to analyze that in mod number B what are the different forces acting on the system so can I can write like this this is 25 G yes or no and we can say here a tension t is acting here if i talk about tension t is also here tension t is also here clear because the person is holding this string at this point i can say tension t in upper direction clear here we can say here total 50 g force is also acting in vertical downward direction clear and we have a normal reaction this is known as capital r clear so from here we can say i can write like this r plus i can say this is t and this should be equal to 50 g clear now we can say from here you can say t is equal to 25 g so i can write like this r this is given by 50 g minus 25 g 
clear so value of r this is given by 25 g clear so if i write here 25 multiply 9.8 i can also write like this this is 98 by 10 clear so i can say this is 2 this is 5 clear i can say this is 49 so value of r this is given by 5 into 49 I can say this is 5 into 50 minus 1 and from here we can say this is 250 minus 5 and this one 245 Newton. Clear everyone? This is 245 Newton. Clear? So I can say uh, total reaction force exerted by a floor on this person this is 245 Newton. Now you can say because uh, we can say because this floor can with stand up to 700 Newton force and we are only just exerting a force 245 Newton it means I can say definitely this floor will be safe yes or no so I can say I will definitely adopt mod number B because it is very safe to raise this block by this method clear but let's suppose if I adopt the mod number A here I can say the total force exerted by me it will be more uh, compared to yield strength of this platform clear it means uh, we can say mod number b is more safe and this is all about this question